this morning by blessing the name of the Lord. Let's adore his holy name. Let's exalt his holy name. Let's thank him because this great and mighty God, he is the lion of the tribe of Judah. Mm -hmm. He is the I am that I am. He's a Father, great and mighty you, God. Lord. Without Lord, him, we, we are nothing. You. Without him, Father, we, we can do nothing on our own. Day. Let's bless oh, his holy name. Let's bless adore him. Lord. Let's exalt him. Oh, because soul. there is none like him. Oh, oh Father, oh, he soul. is the re re redeemer. Oh, he is our king. Oh, he is a healer. He's our Jehovah Rapha, Jehovah Shalom, oh the God our peace. Oh, Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you this morning. Father, we adore you. Oh, we glorify oh, your holy name. We give you all the honor. Ah, we give you all the adoration. I say bless oh, Father, the Lord. we know, we know oh, you God. are the way. You are the truth and you are the life. And that is why this morning we have come oh, into your presence. Jesus. And we ask that you come and tabernacle in our meeting today in the mighty Thank name of Jesus. Man. Father, we ask that you come and take absolute control in the name of Jesus. Every word that we are going to speak tonight, this morning, every word, every prayer, let it come bless the Lord, oh my in the name of Jesus. Take glory, take all the honor, take all the adoration. Father, we bless your name. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. In Jesus' name, we have worshipped. Amen. Amen. And Amen. so, Heavenly Father, we thank you this morning. Thank you, Lord. Father, we bless your holy name. We give you all the glory. Mm -hmm. Oh, Lord, we thank you because thank you, you are the great and mighty King. You are the one who has made it possible for us to be here today. Lord, mm -hmm. we ask that as we begin in your name, Father, tabernacle with us and be with us throughout Amen. this prayer meeting and forever in the name of Jesus. Lord, Amen. let your Holy Spirit be among us wherever we are in our different homes in the name Amen. of Jesus. Lord, let Amen. your Holy Spirit lead us to speak and let your Holy Spirit lead us to hear in the name of Jesus Amen. that Amen. which we are going to hear that will take us to the next level, Father, grant Amen. unto us today in the name of Jesus. Amen. We ask that you Amen. meet each and every one of us at the point of our needs in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let your Amen. name be glorified forever and ever Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. So this Amen. morning, we commit this prayer meeting to your holy hands Amen. in the name of the Father and of Amen. the Son and of Amen. the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Over to you, sir. Thank you very much, Brother Babatunji. That was powerful. More anointing upon your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Over to you, Dr. Precious.
what men fit to do. And he said, yeah. There are mysteries in the spirit. Mysteries. What men fit to do. Let's begin to appreciate God. Let's begin to appreciate God. God is good. God is awesome. God is wonderful. Brethren, don't mind. It is just the network that is misbehaving. The network is misbehaving. But we are in control. Jesus is in control. What Jesus will do in your body today, he will do it. Network or no network. I just want you to be focused. I know our time is going. We have... About 30 minutes to go, I won't go beyond 50 minutes. If you go to, if, if it is five minutes prayer, I'm telling you, you are coming next week to testify in the name of Jesus. Just put a cup of water, a cup of water before you, a cup of water before you. Whatever that is going wrong in your body, I am telling you, the power of God is going to hit that body. And I'm telling you, you are coming back to testify that after the prayer of today, the Lord touched me. The Lord touched me. Even in your dreams, you will see God appearing and ministering to you. Hallelujah. Psalm 61, Psalm 61, verse 1 to 3. Um, I'm going to read. It says, Hear my cry, O God, attend to my prayer. From the end of the earth, I will cry to you. When my heart is overwhelmed, lead me to the rock that is higher than I. For you have been a shelter for me, a strong tower from the enemy. Prayer point number one. Hear my cry, oh my father. Attend to my prayer. Give attention to my prayer request from January through to July. Oh Lord. Hear my cry today. Attend, give attention, Lord, to those requests that I have brought before you in the month of January, in the month of February, in the month of March, in the month of April, in the month of May, in the month of June, in the month of July, that are yet to manifest. Oh, Lord, hear my cry and attend to all those prayers. Begin to pray right now. First prayer point. Begin to pray. Let me begin to hear the energy of your prayer. Begin to pray. O Yamusa, O Yamusa, Liate Katana Pu Katana Pa. Hear my cry, O Lord, today. And I thank Father to all my prayer requests that I brought before you, Father, all this while, beginning from January through to July, in the name of Jesus. My Lord and my God, the request that I brought for uh, uh, before you, Father, concerning myself, my humble self, my care day, my care day, my care day, my care day. Oh, let me put it. Oh, let me put it. Oh, let me put it. We got the cat in our furry arms on the quad. Oh, piyali le put. We are furry arms on to. Elia ke ya de na furry arms on to. Messi adu. Oh, mi ya de na na na. Oh, let me put it. 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 Oh, let me put it.
In Jesus' mighty name we are praised. Amen. King David here, when he was overwhelmed, he did not run to any other God. He ran to the Almighty God. Because he knew that it is the only God that can bail him out of that particular situation he found himself. Brethren, you are going to pray. January, you presented a lot of requests before the Almighty God. February, uh, March, April, May, June, July. Now we are in August. How many months are we left to go to say bye-bye to 2022? Brethren, we are going to pray the same way David prayed. He said, hear my cry. And I give, I, I give attention to my request. We are going to borrow that same prayer point. It's a prayer point. And when we pray the Bible way, we will also get Bible answer. If God could answer David, God must answer us. Because we are children of God. We are God's children. Except you are still living in sin. And if you are still living in sin, please, I, be please, I beg of you. I beg of you. As we are praying, be settling that same problem with the Almighty God. Be asking God to have mercy on you. Because even if it is five minutes prayer you pray today, God will answer. And the only thing that can make your prayer not to be answered, it is sin. Sin. Take away sin from your life. And you will see that God Almighty, he will answer you. King David also fell into sin. He cried to God. He settled that sin with God. And God forgave him. And he moved on. And God, and he cried to God, and God answered him. God will answer you too. Brethren, we are going to pray. Still number one prayer point. Still that same number one prayer point. I want you to remember all the requests you have brought before the Almighty oh, no. God. As God answered those requests, all the, all the prayer requests you have brought before him, the prayer requests of January through to July. No, Papa. Don't even ask for that of August. The one that you have asked so far, from January to July, have you received answers to those quest, uh, to those requests? If not, you better begin to pray the way David prayed. Oh Lord, my Father, you are my Father. I have no other Father in heaven. Have respect, oh God. Of yeah, God. you got a mind before you. Have yeah, respect, oh my Father. Father. Yeah, my God, I Father, right from January, Father, we have been coming, oh Lord, on a weekly basis, presenting our cases before you, making our request known to you, crying out to you. Remember, you have assured us that when we ask, we are going to receive. Father, we have been asking. We have been asking. And we are here to see the manifestation. Father Abraham, as you did for Isaac, 
As you did for Father Jacob, as you did for Jacob, Father, do ours as well. In the name of Jesus, those that are trusting in you, cry out to you to regularize their papers where they are. Father, I thank to the request now that your name might be glorified. Jesus asked us, Jesus told us that we should ask you that you hallow your name. Father, it is time that you hallow your name. By doing all that I have asked you to do, it is time that you have your name. By giving attention, by attending to our request, it is our turn, Father, for our own request to be given attention. It is our turn now, Lord. It is our turn now on this platform. Father, it is our turn. It is our turn. We want to start the miracles happening in our midst. Lord God Almighty, what to see the devil being defeated in our life. Right on this platform. Father, give attention to all our requests in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Second prayer point. It says, From the end of the earth, I will cry to you. When my heart is overwhelmed, lead me to the rock that is higher than I. Look at David here. David, when he was praying, he was so overwhelmed. Only God knew the situation he was going through. I'm sure it was a very unpleasant situation that he could voice out that when he was overwhelmed, that situation almost crushed him. And I can see in my spirit that many of us, we are going through stuff that is already overwhelming us. I know it. I'm sensing it in my spirit for some time now. You know, I'm, I've been sensing it. And that's why by the grace of God, by the grace of God, I'm, I'm planning going on, you know, a time with the Lord, you know, you know, for a few days just to seek the faith of the Lord. I know some of us are going through stuff. Yes, we are going through stuff. That is already over, overwhelming us. We are getting to the point of uh, uh, to give up our faith. He said, is there, still, is there still need for me to continue holding on to this so called God? I've been crying on to Him every now and then, but I can't see anything happening. I'm going through pain. The pain is too much. You are not the only one in that, uh, in that shoe. Somebody called David went through what you are going through. He too also faced a situation that was overwhelming, 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 overwhelming. But what did he do? What did he do? He cried to the Lord. He said, I will cry unto you. I will not cry unto man. I will not cry unto any, any, uh, uh, any demon, any devil. I will not cry unto any any uh, idol, but I will cry unto you because I know that you are the only one that can do it. And you now said, Oh God, lead me to the rock that is higher than I. Lead me. That is the second prayer point. Father, lead me. When God leads you to the rock that is higher than you, who then can bring you down? Who then can bring you down? No. Hey, if God can lead you to the rock that is higher than you, who then can bring you down? The higher of the highest, the greater than the greatest, the stronger than the strongest, leading you to the rock that is higher than you. Who then? Who is that devil? Who is that devil ball? Who is that piece of, uh, of, of devil ball? The God of this age. Who is he to beat you down? A war. We are going to pray. Second prayer point. Oh Lord! Lead me to the rock that is higher than I. Hey, Baba, oh yeah, lead me, Lord. Lead me, Lord, lead me. Baba, Korea, Baba, Teano. Eko keto na Korea, Baba. Father, lead me, lead me, lead me to the rock that is higher than I. Hey, because when you lead me to that rock, when I get to that rock, no man can bring me down. No demon can bring me down. No devil can bring me down. Now look at this. No circumstance can bring me down. No man can bring me down. When you 
are the one that are leading me. We say you are the one leading me to that road. That is higher than I. That is higher than I. Oh, my Savior. My Savior. The Kutena Korea. My real Kutena Korea. The 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 Kutena Korea. Second prayer point. We we'll get that from Isaiah 59, 19b. Isaiah 59, 19b. And I'm reading it from New King James Version. And this is the last prayer point. Like I said, I want you to pray. By the grace of God, we will play our part to make sure that we, we, uh, we do not exceed the 60 minutes. God helping us. Isaiah 59, 19b, New King James Version. It says, when the enemy comes in like a flood, the spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against him. Brethren, I want to coin this scripture. Um, just bear with me. I'm not, trying to, uh, I'm not trying to present error or fallacy, but I just want you to look at it this way. If you look at this scripture the way uh, I have read it from New King James Version, you will see that the way the, the perception you will derive from this scripture is that the enemy is so big, is so great, insurmountable, like a flood. Because he said, if, if, if you apply the rule of grammar, the rule of grammar, say when the enemy comes in like a flood, there's a comma. 
then the spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against him. So if you look at that scripture, you will see that it's like it, the, the enemy is being presented like a very mighty, a very big, you know, thing, like a flood. Picture a flood. <laughs> then that is the way, that is the perception, that is the image that will come to you, the way the enemy is. But brethren, now I want you to turn it around. Turn it around. We in this dispensation, we shouldn't begin to see our challenge, our problem as big as a flood. But now, turn it around. How? See, now, the same scripture, I'm going to read it. But see the way I'm going to read it now. I'm going to remove that comma from that flood. I will relocate it and put it after in. I am. In. I will, then I will now apply the same rule of grammar. To read, they you will not see the, the way the, the picture will not change in your mind now. Let's go. I'll read after removing that comma from that flood and put it uh, after I and in. I'll read when the enemy comes in, I will pause because there's a comma like a flood, the spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against him. Can you begin to see another picture that is being formed in your in your in your image? Uh, uh, sorry, in your imagination. Let me read it again. When the enemy comes in, that is when the enemy comes to attack you. I pause because there's a comma. Like a sword, the spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against him. Do you see it now? Now, what picture are you getting? Now you begin to see the spirit of God like a flood. Like a rushing screen, uh, a stream. This is the best perception you can have, the best image. We should begin in this dispensation. We should begin to see the spirit of God, God Himself, bigger and greater and higher and stronger than our challenge. We should begin to see our challenge so small and see God big. You know. So when you read this scripture this way, that when the enemy comes in, and you pause, like a flood, the spirit of the Lord, begin to see the spirit of the Lord coming like a flood, like a rushing flood, to do what? To attack the enemy. He said, he said, he said like a flood, the spirit of the Lord will lift up the standard against him. What picture does that carry in your mind? It carries the picture of God attending to your situation, sharp, sharp. Hallelujah. That is what I want to achieve. And if I were you, from today, begin to read this verse that way. Don't see the enemy like a flood. See him as, a, as, as, as in Yoruba, we call it binti, binti, see him as something that is so tiny. And see God, a mighty God, like a flood. See the Holy Spirit like a mighty Holy Spirit. Oh, hallelujah. This reminds me. I remember some years ago, I had a dream. And in that dream, the devil appeared to me. I saw the devil. He appeared to me, and he came with, he, uh, he came with, uh, behind me was so dark, and before me was this halogen light, so bright. When I had that dream, I knew that my future is bright. But behind me was so dark. Thick darkness. And that devil came out of that darkness, stylishly. And he came with two apples. He was pretending as if he was eating one. And he now offered me the second one. I looked at it. I said, I don't want. He tried to entice me to take it, to eat. I said, no, I don't want. When he saw that all his enticement did not work, the next thing I heard him saying was, I am the devil. Very clearly, I'm quoting him. He said, I am the devil. And immediately, what happened? Life began to go out of me. And I was dying. I tried to shout Jesus. I could not. And the, the darkness was about warning me. And I was dying in that dream. I was going. Life was going away. And suddenly, uh, in front of me, I saw cloud coming. Cloud coming. Cloud. And you know, cloud always represent the presence of the Almighty God. 
When I saw that cloud coming, as the cloud was coming, I began to receive strength and I came back to life. And the darkness just disappeared. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are going to pray. The next prayer point. Our last prayer point. Oh Lord. Lord. Like a like a rushing flood. Rushing flood. Let the Holy Spirit lift up a standard against every power challenging my life.
Thank you, Jesus. Right now, the water I ask you to put before you, I believe it's there right now. I want to pray now in the next three minutes. I want to pray and then we shut down. And, and as I pray, it is not me doing it, it is Jesus. Because Jesus told me, he said, he will manifest himself. He said, he will manifest himself. Whenever we have programs, he, said, he will manifest. Yes, you can see where, it is. where is it? Go and read First John 3, 8. I'm, personalized, I'm personalizing it. Jesus said, or the Bible says, the Holy Spirit said, that for this purpose, for this purpose, Christ was manifested to destroy the works of the devil. How God anointed Jesus, who went about doing good. Do you know that Jesus is still busy? He said, and he went with them, confirming his word, following him. Jesus is here to confirm his word. And what is his word? He said, this word is, he will manifest. He will manifest. God, God, Jesus is going to manifest himself into, in that water. And as you drink it, whatever is going wrong in your body is being destroyed now. It's being destroyed now. It's being destroyed now. It's being destroyed now. I don't care how long it has been in that body. I don't care. I don't want to know. Whatever it is, whatever it is, that thing that defies medical solution. Now, as you drink that water, the power of God, the anointing of God to enter into that water. Because Amen. Look, listen to, listen to me. It is where the driver directs the car. The car goes. It mm. is where the pilot directs the, the aircraft. The aircraft goes. It is where the sailor directs the ship. The ship goes. Therefore, this day, the anointing that is present now, we direct, we direct that anointing to enter into that water. And mm. that anointing mm. should carry out the to carry out the work of deliverance, to carry out the work of healing, whatever mm -hmm. is going wrong, whatever seed that my father has not planted in you, whatever tree that my father has not planted in you, that the enemy has planted, I command as you drink that water in the name of Jesus, the books are cut hard and mm hard. -hmm. The power of Almighty God to enter into their body and to give that water. Amen. And to write everything wrong that the enemy has done in that body. In the Amen. name of Jesus, who has been from getting married all these years, all these years, that evil Amen. man, that evil man that the enemy put upon Amen. you, that made you not to get married. As you drink that water, in the name of Jesus, the power of the devil is broken. In the name of Jesus, the power of the devil is broken. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Working and 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 you're not making any estimate. You walk like an elephant and you're eating like, a, like, like an ant. As you drink that water, in the name of Jesus, Whatever is that spell working against your prosperity, whatever is that spell working against you getting that employment, is broken now. It's broken now. It's broken now. It's broken now. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we say thank you. Thank you, Lord. Lord, we say thank you. Thank you, Jesus. You will deliver safely. Amen. If the enemy could not stop you from getting pregnant, no power can stop you from bringing that baby forth. Mm -hmm. The day of delivery, you have to preserve, your baby is also preserved. Mm -hmm. As you drink that water, mm -hmm. in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. It happened to mm -hmm. before me. I told her that drink this water for this number of days, before all of the day, all of before you drink that water, that baby will come forth. And so it was. Today, she's rejoicing. Very soon she come and give her testimony. Mm -hmm. You are the next to testify in the mm -hmm. name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. Father, we mm -hmm. thank you. Mm -hmm. Lord, we thank mm -hmm. you for our sister who went in for operation just about a few hours ago. She went in, we stood by her, and she came out there in the U.S. Father, thank you for that success, uh, mm -hmm. successful surgery. Father, we say thank you. She went in, she came out. Hallelujah. Father, we pray for her, Sister Biola. Let your healing be permanent in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Quick recovery, quick recovery in the name of Jesus. Yeah. And your next place of assignment, the Lord God Almighty, honor before your recovery, the Lord to 
catapult you there in the name mm -hmm. of Jesus. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. God bless you all for logging in. Mm -hmm. We appreciate you all. We are Stanley in webinar. God bless you for logging in. God bless you. We will meet on Thursday. Uh, Brother Stanley, uh, Thursday, uh, US time. Okay, we'll meet again um, next week by the grace of God. And I'm trusting God that the Lord God Almighty is going to bless us mightily. Sorry, I'm two minutes late. I was targeting five dots. No, I mean dot five or 11 dot. But it's okay, I'm improving. Hallelujah. All right. Can I hear your powerful hallelujah? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God bless you all. All right. We'll see you again. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. The fragrance of my worship rolls up to the Father. Noises, thunderings, earthquakes were the response to my worship. The fragrance of my worship rolls up to the Father. Noises, thunderings, lightnings were the response to my worship. The fragrance of my Thank you.